Hey, this is Rick Cassell from ExercisesForInjuries.com. I wanted to go through a quadratus lumborum stretch for you. So I'm lying down, feet are relaxed, knees bent, upper body's relaxed, arms out to the side. Now I'm going to cross one leg, the foot over the opposite knee. And now I'm going to draw both knees to the opposite side of what I want to stretch, or the side that I want to stretch. So I'm dropping the knees to the left side in order to stretch that right side quadratus lumborum. I'm dropping the knees. I'm really trying to focus on relaxing, relaxing that upper body, feeling that stretch in that right quadratus lumborum area around that pelvis, top of the pelvis to the bottom ribs. Now I'm bringing it back. And now I'll just end up kind of showing you a different angle doing the stretch. So lying back, arms out to the side, crossing the leg over, dropping to the left in order to stretch this right-sided quadratus lumborum. Uh, doing my best to stay relaxed, upper body's relaxed, and trying to focus in on that quadratus lumborum area stretching out. So this is Rick Aselge from ExercisesForInjuries.com with an easy and quick quadratus lumborum stretch that you can do that really kind of targets one of the muscles that oftentimes is overactive and tight if you're weak in, the, in, in uh, your core stability, the hip muscles. So if you are a fitness professional, swing by the blog exercisesforinjuries.com and get your $299 fitness education gift. So this is Rick Casalge saying take care and bye-bye.